we cannot compare our war. I mean, the war of Russia against Ukraine, I wouldn't say that there is a significant religious discrepancies between our countries. This is the war of this man. He had this idea. And we can't uh, compare with a, with a situation, with a war, with the crisis, with all these crises in the Middle East. What came with Russia? Now it's all destroyed. There's no tourism there. Absolutely. And all the same, after Georgia, they did to Ukraine. In all the cases, they were finding the reasons. But in any case, the methodology is all the same. They have the people, uh, their own forces there. They cut the peace. They, uh, they keep their own forces there. And they're destroying the whole region. My name is Ashok Raj from ANI. The another part of the world is also fighting for their regions. Uh, I'm talking about Israel and Gaza, and there is a fight for the religions' uh, differences, like Islam and others. What's your take and thoughts about Israel and Gaza? Gaza, and do you think that uh, Islamist uh, jihads are uh, the concerns for the new world of era? First and foremost, we cannot compare this because you've mentioned the re religious differences and we cannot compare our war. I mean, the war of Russia against Ukraine, I wouldn't say that there is a significant religious discrepancies between our countries. There's different, there's a lot of uh, different religions. And I guess the same religions are available in Russia. So it's not a war that has anything to do with religious discrepancies. This is a war of a one person. One person, that's it, who came to that. And I wouldn't be comparing that war as well, because in, in our case, we have a person that is gradually doing all these steps. It came to Moldova in the beginning of 90s, so what happened when the countries restored their independence and uh, there was a dependent of the Soviet Union and then the policy of the Russian Federation, well, it started wasn't, with Putin and he continued this policy. He had become, has become a true Hitler in this policy. And this direction says the return of the influence it started before him, because it was like a frozen conflict. There's uh, all these same manual uh, as it was in Moldova. They occupied a part of this country. They cut a piece, the Transnistria. They cut it. They, uh, they were saying that they kind of protect the local population with their own forces. And the same thing they've done in Chechnya. They've destroyed everything. They killed all the people, everyone who had their own kind of voice or the independence. The next step, if you remember, was in 2008. That was in Georgia. And all the same, they um, sent their tanks and forces to the country. They cut a piece in Abkhazia? What, do they have Russians living in Abkhazia? No. The people uh, who live there, they speak the same language as Georgia. So in all the cases, they were finding the reasons. But in any case, the methodology is all the same. They have the people, uh, their own uh, forces there. They cut the peace. They, uh, they keep their own forces there. And they're destroying the whole region. Because Abkhazia, it's... Uh, a long distance from you, even though you're a journalist, you know a lot, but I'm not sure you've been to Abkhazia. But I've been there. I've been to Transnistria and to Moldova. I've uh, uh, been to Georgia many times and I've been to Abkhazia. So once during the Soviet times, it was a recreational area and it was very popular. They have a unique nature in there. They have a unique climate and a unique recreational facilities. Now, what came with Russia? Now it's all destroyed. There's no tourism there. Absolutely. And all the same, after Georgia, they did to Ukraine. They came into Crimea and they cut the Crimea. They cut the Donbas. 
Once again, there was a recreational area. Three million Ukrainians were having holidays, were spending holidays in Crimea. They lived in Crimea. Now imagine, once again, zero tourism, economy is uh, zeroed, and the region is kind of destroyed. So everywhere, the same steps being taken, there's nothing new here. This one man, sorry, sir, this is the war of this man. He had this idea, and we can't it, uh, compare with a, with a situation, with a war, with the crisis, with all these crises in the Middle East.